What is going on guys? Greggles TV. I just got back from CES about a week ago and a company reached out to me before I went to CES to come check out some of their technology. It's called Deep Frame and I was invited to you know, like a private suite to actually see this technology uh, at the uh, Aria Hotel in Casino in Las Vegas and um, it's this mixed reality technology that allows you to see a person and they can see you back and you can talk to each other. Uh, it's gonna be used in like uh, customer service type cases or like at museums, things like that. So there's really a lot of use cases for it, but I wanted to tell you before you watch the video, what I captured of it didn't come out that great. I tried two different cameras. I tried my DSLR, and I actually even tried my phone, and my phone actually recorded it slightly better just because of the lighting, so it kind of washes out the person that I'm talking to, but if you actually ever get to see this technology live, you'll be amazed by it. It's really, really clear, really crisp, so what I recorded, don't take it as, oh my God, it's kind of washed out. I can't see what I'm looking at. It's not like that, so just to give you the idea of what it looks like, you know, watch the video, and if you have any other questions or comments, leave them down below. I'll also leave the website for Deep Frame down below as well. Enjoy. Klaus, what's going on? How are you? <laughs> I'm good, thanks. I'm here to present Deep Frame on new patent pending technology. I know, I've only seen it for like 15 minutes, and I'm actually very impressed with this technology. I think it's a really cool technology. It's futuristic. It's kind of like when I saw Back to the Future, the movie, and the, kid, the guys on the screen, you're video chatting. It's, it feels like that. And one of the first things I noticed is when you came on the screen, the very first time I saw you, I thought it was a recording, but you responded back to me instantly. That's awesome. Tell me more about this technology. So the technology deep frame is basically a window that mixes the real world with the virtual. In this case, I'm a virtual presenter. So that concept here is me presenting or speaking to you in this case live. But this concept also allows me to bring in other virtual elements, like, for example, my little friend. So this could be awesome for museums, right? Yeah. For experience centers. Yeah. That's one of the cool things that when you bring in that creature, you know, because it is a digitized image, it's even clearer. Like, you're clear, but it even is clearer than that. So that's amazing. What are some use cases for this technology for you guys to use with? Obviously, I can. You're not going to use it with mom and mom and dad. You're going to use it with companies and, and, and organizations. What kind of? What are some of the use cases that you'll use this with? Well, what you're seeing here is our uh, our product for display at public locations, and that means for us museums, experience centers, but it also does mean shopping malls and retail, because retail is becoming more and more about the physical experience that differentiates them from the online training, right? Yeah. So experiencing a product, like for instance, when I have to explain about technology, I would rather sort of deep dive and explain about details like this, and I think that's quite interesting yeah. in terms of, you know, only having to look at the user. Yeah. I think one of the cool things about this is that you can actually, companies can outsource workers from either other countries or, or locations and still give that, you know, amazing customer service that is really popular now with companies, you know, because customer service sometimes is the only thing companies can give you and I think this will definitely enhance that for sure. Um, so this provides a presence, right, and, yeah. and an engagement. Yeah, I agree. I like it. So, last question. What is your favorite thing about this technology? Well, we've always been dreaming about being able to recreate the, the thing that appeared in front of us in Star Wars the first time. So this is our dream come true, the, the sort of as true as possible hologram life. It's awesome. I'm really impressed with it. I can't wait to see more of this as time goes on. So thank you, Klaus, for uh, letting me see this and talk to you. Thank you. Thanks.